again, this is Robert Veach here. This is my video review of a Whirlpool microwave oven. And this is model WMC2005YB. And the B is for the black color, um, the top and sides. All of them have black in the front. You could also get a white back with a W. And I think there's a stainless steel one, an S, that looks like stainless steel. It's painted. Now this microwave I purchased about four years ago and it's still working fine. The reason I really liked it is because it has a very, very small profile. It's rated at uh, 0.5 cubic feet and 750 watts of power. It has uh, 10 power levels has a 30 second timer option, quick touch controls, and a popcorn button and a reheat button right there, and a defrost button. It weighs 33 pounds, and the dimensions are 13 by 15.4 by 14.1. It's made by Whirlpool, and it has a one year warranty on the device. Now, I'm gonna show you how this works. Very Typical microwave, but what's interesting is that even though it has such a small outside profile, it still has a large inside because they didn't occupy any space for the electronics, it's all in the base. And that's a really good idea because it ends up being small on your counter, but you can fit a lot of stuff in here. So I typically use this to warm up sauces and coffee and tea and make microwave popcorn. It works really well. Kind of looks like a little TV from the 40s, which is kind of neat. So you have a cancel off button, and then you have start. And you can see it goes to 30 seconds. And every time you hit that, it increases it by 30 seconds. Which is a nice quick way to add more time to whatever you're warming up. You can cancel it right there. You have cook power levels where you can hit and you can do the different percentages of power, which is nice. You have a defrost button, which uh, has a fixed amount of time, it's 11 minutes and 50 seconds, and it will cycle the power to defrost things that are solid, like solid pieces of meat. It works really well with that. You also have a reheat button, and you could then change the power level on that too and reheat is very short amount of time. Let's hit it again. Yeah, it's just meant to be really, really short amount of time not to overheat anything. And if you order the popcorn, it looks like it's set to one minute and 20 seconds. Now, when I make popcorn, I make a pretty big batch and it fits nicely in here. And it ends up being uh, about three and a half minutes to make the popcorn and it works perfectly. Now to set the time on here, you could uh, there's a little, you could hold this for three seconds, and then you could increase the time, and hit it again, and then you could set your time. Here is the back of the unit. You can see it has ventilation holes, and it's all curved nicely, so you have a unique profile that takes up minimal space on your counter. Comes with a typical. US plug. The plug is about three and a half feet long and it's pretty heavy gauge. So what's my final opinion on this uh, Whirlpool WMC2005YB microwave half a cubic foot countertop 750 watts. I really like this unit. We've had it for four and a half years. It's worked flawlessly. It really works well. The inside is bigger than you'd ever need but the outside is very small as I demonstrated. So I'm going to give this product a full five-star rating on my channel. I hope this video review helped you with your buying decisions. Thanks for watching.